Y'all, <laughs> we are frazzled this morning. Look, look, I was in the way of that big boat. Big boat. Now he's getting ready to back up probably. I'm gonna be in his way again. Paul was just, uh, he was so late. I got here and he was waiting on me late. No, 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 you're gonna watch my video. <sighs> I did an intro he got, earlier. <sighs> anyway, Paul got here early. Yes. I wasn't, I was two minutes before the appointed time, but I will say this, Paul is unsupervised this week. He, he, when he is not under supervision, and you know, I'm not, I didn't tell him, but his wife told me that I could supervise Paul <laughs> this week as long as I was under supervision of my supervisor. That's right. So as long, if I'm under the supervision of my supervisor, then I could supervise Paul. And right now I'm unsupervised, so. Your supervisor's was, gone? No, she's here. She's okay. just not here. Oh, she's not I mean, here. she's not, Ooh. you know, watching us pull out. Or she could be up there on the bank. I don't know. But I'm unsupervised and I'll, you know, I'm, I could do anything right now. Speaking of doing anything, let me okay. tell you guys, let me, t let me tell you folks that follow Chris. Oh, uh, what? Here's my morning for you. Uh -oh. We got a new Keurig. You know, Keurig. That's a Keurig for you people that are from south. Whatever. Whatever. Anyway, go ahead. Just and those words. Carry. Carry. Got a new coffee maker that you can put in individual cups in. True. Okay, so I got up this morning. I'm, I mean, I've been awake since three because yeah. I'm unsupervised. Unsupervised, going yeah. crazy. I get up, put that in, yeah. put my cup in, hit the button, went to do something else, and I hear it running. I'm like, oh, good. Awesome. I forgot to put the cup in. So you got to put the cup <laughs> under the thing, right? That's true. Okay, now that I've had a Keurig for years. I mean, yeah, that's a common mistake, right? Abs I guess, yeah. Okay, so I cleaned that up. Okay, which is great. So I got smarter. I put a new cup in. I put a new little you know, yeah. coffee thing in. Yeah. Hit the button. Put my coffee cup in. Okay, now we're getting smart. All right. Yes. Went to the bathroom. Yeah, unsupervised. Unsupervised. Came back. There's coffee all over my counter. <laughs> I put the coffee cup upside down. <laughs> How'd you make up it on time? How'd you get here before down. me? I was up, I've been up at five since five. I was relaxing and upside, looking on the computer. Folks, oh my lord. Ugh. So then I finally ate my third cup of coffee. There's more. After I cleaned, the, cleaned up the counter, yeah. I got a third cup of coffee and it actually works. It works great if your coffee cup's upside right where yeah. it catches the water. It can be good. It catches the, the, yeah. the liquid. Well, all, all I know is that we better catch some fish today. Oh After God. this introduction, Woo! this is the best introduction we've ever done. That's the, that's the, oh my, I was so mad. All right, pull out. Paul's out. Number two on, guys. Ooh, he's a tugger. Y'all didn't get to see mine, but now look at Paul. He's got a good one. Man, I got my line out. I'm trying to video. I'm not really helping Paul in any kind of way. I'm reeling. That's a good one, Paul. Yeah, we're and we're up. keeping trout today, That's so a he's a trout. he's a uh, he is a candidate, a candidate for the live well. Nice. It's a good start to the day. I'm sorry you guys didn't get to see my fish that I it's, caught. Look, look at, That's what Chris. It looked, looked like. just like that. Yeah, except it was a little small. Tiny. Not not much. Oh, but whoa, I mean, whoa, whoa! He Chris killed it. Fish. He absolutely. About pull the pole out of my hand, Paul. These guys are monsters. They are glad to be eaten. I know that. Aggressive. Uh, he's borderline. Borderline. You caught him on the border? Yeah, I caught him right on the border of Georgia and Florida. Right up there. You gonna measure him anyway? Yeah. He's fat. He's, he's too small. No, Paul, look. He's 14 and a half. All right. I mean, if my measuring thing works the way I think it does. I mean, last time I got a fish that looked like it might be small, Paul called the DNR. I did. Told them where we were and that they should come out here and check because he's a, you know, a little tattletale. And I mean, I hate to resort to name calling. But you're tattletale. I am. He is a snitches. And y'all know snitches get Aww. stitches. That was a good throw too. 
I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna let my camera just run. I don't know how long we're gonna catch those fish because the first one was about 20 yards to the right, and the last two were right here on the left. So I cut Paul off from being able to throw to the left. It's very important. Defensive uh, fishing 101. What passed us? A battleship? Well, I, I take that back. He called 911. Yeah. And then <laughs> yeah. they told him to call. They called him. They called DNR. My partner's keeping fish. I don't know if they're legal. And they said, Is this an emergency? Well, this is me. And he said, For the fish, it is. <laughs> Let me get my pole out of the way. This guy is, I mean, bossy now. You want to talk about bossy? He slammed it. He's a trout, I believe. Uh, I mean, I don't think I have to have the mint. Oh, this is a nice red. Oh, it's a red. Yes, it is. Here we go. Getting ready. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? There he goes. Woo! Doggy. Redfish. Nice one. Damn. What do you say about that with your new sunglasses on? I just want to thank Knuckleheads. That's right. Bait and Tackle for That's sponsoring right. me and allowing me to buy, to, to buy these <laughs> sunglasses and purchase the shrimp. That's right. For them, because that's isn't that how sponsorship goes? That's right. You buy the bait. you buy the stuff and then yes, they sir. get the credit for you. So there you go. Knew if I came here. It might be a keeper, I don't know. It's hard to know, Paul. I mean, I'm reeling into the wind, I'm reeling a fish, and I'm reeling against the current. That ain't even close to being. There's a lot of things that are against me here. Yeah. This fish is really against me right now. He's fighting. Nice looking trout, though, Chris. He is. Nice looking trout. He's got nice spots. They're spaced out really pretty. Uh-huh. So he's handsome. It's pretty close. <laughs> now I've got some other. Uh, do you I need have, a? I have other bobbers. I'm just not. You're not big. It's big. My brother. There he goes. Man, that's not a big trout. I am not a smart man. No, I just sideways. Paul's got a sideways fish. I'm trying to block you guys from the wind. <laughs> trying to protect, protect my peeps. Woo! Oh, that's a little better one, Paul. Yeah. A better. Yeah, he's a little guy. Okay. Folks, we're at the deadliest catch <laughs> fish right now. I don't know. The wind just keeps going. Y'all probably can't hear a word I'm saying. And higher. Well, we went from the best day ever to the worst day ever in about 0 0.2 seconds. Mm -hmm. The wind, the weather clowns have yes. fooled us again. Y'all probably can't even hear me. No. The wind is blowing. It, it's supposed to be blowing about 7 to 9 miles an hour. We think it's, we're estimating 15 to 20 Easy. yards an hour. Yeah. I mean a mile an mile hour. Half. But it's, anyway, we're going home. We yeah. were catching, ah, oh, it's so upset. It's upsetting. Anyway, sorry, that's the way it is, guys. When you're out we wheel. caught fish, 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 yeah, quickly. fish, fish. We caught fish, fish, <laughs> and we're going home, home. <laughs> I'm home. I don't want to clean, clean. Because of the wind, wind. <laughs> See y'all later. <laughs>